Hey everybody, it's David Wilkes. I just wanted to lead into this video today. Um, this is my very first Rush Adobe, or Adobe Rush video that I've edited and put together on my cell phone. So give me a little comment below on how that works and what it looks like to you guys. Um, we're talking about Baby Shap today. We took Baby Shap out um, Sunday to do a water test. It's really important to do a water test on a boat because the things that you know are revealed on a water test certainly can't be done while the motor's sitting on a hose. Um, we had an issue with the trim solenoid. You're going to see in the video that I took the handle apart, messed with this twin, the trim switch, the twim width, the trim switch. Um, the, as you'll see, the, the, the switch has a red, a green, and a blue wire. Um, it's an industry standard that green is grass, blue is sky, green is down, blue is up, and the power usually comes in a version of a, of a red or a black wire for most trim systems. Um, we traced it back. You see me grab a hammer because that's what James had in his truck. Um, I lightly, gen on, you know, I gently and lightly tapped on it um, to get the, you know, see if there was any corrosion while James hit the little switch. And um, that made no difference at all. So we started looking at the contacts, um, cleaned a couple contacts, checked fuses, and we finally got it, you know, so the trim system would work. We could take the boat off the trailer and away from the ramp. Um, then you'll see I'm idling out, waiting for Sharon to park the truck and was putting, you know, transition from, from idle to running. The engine had a little stall, stall. It was a little rough in the video when we had the engine running before during the live stream, um, at idle. So once we get up to speed, you'll see that the engine smooths out. This is an indicator that we have sticking lifters and a little cylinder imbalance, and we're going to address that with it now. Once again, this is all the reasons why you water test, because things that happen on the hose are completely different than the things that happen while you're on the water or when the customer has delivered the boat. This is, you know, it, it, it's so important that I, I water test these things so that if I say it's done, it's done, and it's done right. So... Check out the video, tell me what you think. Um, and just a couple of notes, we went to the sandbar for about an hour, let it heat soak. Wanted to do that so that when we started the boat back up, James brought his boat in case we had any issues. Um, he could tow us in if we had problems with the engines or something, at, or the engines, engine, um, in case there was something that I saw that I didn't want to continue to run the boat with. So all being said, enjoy the video, leave me some comments. Again, this is my first Rush video, you know, from the new Adobe app. Um, let me know what you think. Anyway, have an absolutely blessed day, and God bless America. So just to give you an idea of where we're at with this motor right now is we've gotten to the water, um, and now the engine won't trim up or down. We've come back here with the switch. I've tried jumping it with a wire, so it's not just the switch. So now we're going to resort to a hammer and I'm going to wrap on that trim motor back there, right back there, and uh, see if it's got some corrosion, if it'll break free and we'll kind of go from there. Alright, we redid the uh, connections, took the solenoid out, cleaned the contacts on it, and got the drive to go down. Um, so now I'm gonna, we're in the water, we're floating. I put it in reverse. I close that, I still got the ladder down, so I'm gonna pull up to the dock in a second. And uh, we're gonna see if we can get the, this boat to go through its paces. Youngster in the water. The boat is idling. The 
only stingray on the water today. <laughs> and uh, another peaceful, successful day to hit the water. Just put the fire out. <laughs> Time to head back. Sharon's gonna back the truck down the, the ramp. <laughs> she just laughed. <laughs> so like, whatever. There's beautiful cypress trees. Push it. Push it while well, not. There you go. 